Frida Kahlo was rebellious, intense, enigmatic, passionate, contradictory, very strong. At the same time, she was caring, um, loving, and unique. I'm Circe Nestrosa, I'm the co-curator of the exhibition Frida Kahlo Making Herself Up at the Victorian Albert Museum. Frida Kahlo today is the most important Mexican artist. She has been appropriated by fashion designers, by the feminist movement, by artists, by popular culture. People connect and then that's why they appropriate her and that's why it's relevant to show her archive today. She was born in 1907, actually Frida used to change her day and make it coincide with the year of the revolution because she wanted to be a child of the revolution. Two events will define Carlos's life. Her polio at the age of six left her with, um, with the right leg shortened than the left leg. And then later on at the age of 18, when she had an almost fatal accident and she had around 30 surgical interventions to the point she had in 1953 her leg amputated. This was the beginning of the career of a fantastic artist but also the beginning of the, ter the deterioration of her body. Later on she meets um, Diego Rivera and in 1929 they get married. discover 6,000 photographs, 12,000 documents, around 300 personal belongings of the artist. By looking at her uh, personal belongings, I met her for the first time. I found a, a, a woman who was incredibly sophisticated, who loved makeup, who loved dressing up. At the time, the fashion was not indigenous. It was very much influenced by Europe and Hollywood. So when starting this uh, research in, in this project, I wanted to know why Frida adopted the Tijuana dress as her logo. The Tijuanas come from the Tehuantepec Isthmus. It is a, a matriarchal society administrated by women, so the women take care of the money and they go to the markets and they make their clothes and they sell their clothes. So this is a dress that will help her portray her political beliefs. It symbolizes um, powerful women. I have a very personal connection with this project because I am a wearer of the Tijuana dress. This is a Rabona uh, skirt and these are typical from, from Oaxaca, from the same region of the Isthmus of Tehuantepec. So this would be an example of some of the pieces you will see in the exhibition. My great aunt and my great uncle were part of the um, circle of intellectuals at the time. And my aunt used to bring some of Frida's Wipilis to her. This exhibition can inspire um, young people and inspire um, women and men in general, I mean, um, to see again how how such an important artist uh, defined herself in her own terms. Mm -hmm.